He's dead. We found his body in his car with blood all over him. We think Rufus and his men must have beaten him up. He shouldn't have gone to the car park all on his own. What the Mafia did to him was way out of the line. We hired a meathead Mafia to go to Marshall for refusing to tell them where Jerry is. And we want to know exactly why you're defending Jerry in the first place. That's because Jerry Mitchell is innocent, innocent, and he had to free a way to prevent the Mafia from trying to kill him. No matter what has happened to him, his memories will always live on. Let's give a toast to the man who was always there for us, to Joshua. Hello? Is anybody home? Boo. Yikes. Where on earth did you come from? You locked the front doors, so I used the back. Sorry, I freaked out. I thought it was an intruder. Like intruders knock first. But hey, at least this place is safer than in Minecraft Shia. I heard that you were once a reporter there. Yeah, until I quit my job and told Milton where to stick it. So I see. Hey guys. Wow. Nice place. Did you buy it? For about six million dollars, yes. And yeah, I really am rich. Who even owns this place? Kim Kardashian? Well, there's this studio down the road called Logo ID Studios. We can pop in there from time to time. Good idea. I'll manage my shifts if necessary. I'm just glad that Milton never knows I'm here. Alright, are we all ready? Only if Michael is up to it. Michael, have you calmed down yet? Yes, I am. I'm sorry I cried before. That's understandable. Michael, we all get these feelings sometimes. All right. What is this? Hey, you. Who? Me? Yes, you. That's my Pepsi Max you're drinking. Give it back. Oh, come on. What is your problem? I was just thirsty for a drink. That's all. I'd call that a theft. If you don't bring back my drink, I'm calling the police. There's no need to do that. I live here. Wait. Are you? Yes, Sam. I'm Jose Betancourt. I'm the new guy here. Pleasure to meet ya, Jose. Yeah, make yourself at home. Thanks, guys. I sure do like being here. Sorry I was being a loud mouth. I thought it was an actual thief. Jose Betancourt. I thought his name was Lul. Just Jose would be good. I stand corrected. Now, do we mind getting started? On one condition. Don't make these intro segments too long, because you would make everyone click off this video. Aw, oh, shucks. I just broke the fourth wall. Well, at least you were lucky that you didn't make the fourth wall house explode again. But anyway, Let's just not waste our time and begin. Light! Camera! Action! This is PBS. Big Brother UK? Yep, that's right. This is what the new Big Brother I logo will look like. Is that a CBS eye? In the middle of the pupil? I think it is. What is this? Some sort of a joke? I thought this was just a family logo for the Big Brother reboot, but it's not. It's actually real. Big Brother sees it all. Big Brother is watching. Big Brother will get back to you. And so it will. BBC Video I guess, after this video is over, we'll be watching Doctor Who on VHS. Not BBC Video, PBS. Change it. This is PBS. No. It's not Paramount DVD, it's PBS. Do you even know where the proper logo is? Where? In Scandinavia. <laughs> This is PBS. Public boardy servers. Who's boardy? Is he the smart board? Take a gander. Ruffle, 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 ruffle. 
This is PBS. Shovelware's Brain Game. Ghosted by the one and only dancing banana. Chuck Bird plays that game all the time. But who's got the biggest brain of all? It's Yellow Bird. Who else got it? Survey says. This is PBS. Stop you. Shut up! You tell him, Wally. This is not bread coiny service. This is PBS. If you screw it up again, you're done for. If you dare fire Scotty Mike, you'll get a car battery falling on you. Capiche? Sheesh. Shush the sheesh. Radar overseer Scotty. Yo, now we're fired. Fired? No, 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 damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, Microsoft Mike, how dare you do this to me, and this is wrongful termination, and I'll see you in court for it, you do the stiffest, 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 That does it, Mike. Firing Scotty was the last straw. Put me down, Wally. This is insubordination. I ought to sue you for this. When hell freezes over, out you go. Later, after the gang brought Scotty back. This is PBS. Super Nintendo Entertainment System. Whoever remembers owning this as a childhood. Now you're playing with power. Super power. All right, what's the big idea? What is Scotty doing back here? Don't you remember, Mike? You fired me. And we had to bring him back and Wally threw you out because of what you've done. This is mutiny. Mutiny! Schmutiny! You stay out of it. I ought to refire Scotty for this. If you do that, Mike, I'll make you sorry. Make me. Later, after Mike underwent counseling sessions to have his control freak tendencies removed. This is PBS. Sorry, have I come at a bad time? Not at all. You must be Alex Chapman's replacement. That's funny. Because my name is also Alex. But you can call me Alex6101 sometimes. Welcome to our crew, Alex. Glad to be here. Jeez, the traffic is almost like in New York. Yeah. You can't even begin to tell how long that lasted. Oh look, Dan, D, D, M, and F and Gamer have returned. Let me guess, are they back for another visit? Well, no actually, Ethan and I have come to stay here permanently. Dan and I were hired here as replacements for Cootie and DJ Lunchpood since they are no longer in the G4P TV community. At least it's nice to have you back full time. We missed you both. Gee, it feels like 2019 all over again. Do you remember the time that Cortana was a circle? Yes, but now she's been humanized. I mean, what can possibly go wrong today? What are you doing here? I thought you were in the hospital. Stuff the hospital. There's another reason why I needed to talk to you. Don't you even think about it, Jimmy. Whatever it is, I am not listening. You have tried to kill me. I was brain damaged, but I still remember what you've done. It was just an accident, Jimmy. Why can't we get the facts straight? Because you are a coward, Hank. You always have been. I always knew you tried to kill James and all the others with an enderman. How many times did I tell you, Jimmy? I did not attack those people. Are you sure about that? Yes. Then I'll go to the police. I'll tell them that you almost made me lose a brain. But you can't do that. You can't hurt me in. Can you please give me more time to- No more excuses. I mean it. You are going to prison, and that's the best you could get. I'll make sure of it. This 
is PBS. Hey guys, what do you think of my new haircut? Whoa, Mafias! You look fantastic! That's exactly the same hair that I have. Well, my old look was getting obsolete anyway. How exactly did you grow your own hair? Did you use shampoo? Just kidding. Ha 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 Now what the heck was that? Did I just hear Sweet Caroline playing on the logo? Sweet e e e e e e e and Caroline. Good times never seemed so good. I've been inclined to believe they never would, but now I look at the night and it don't seem so lonely. Neil Diamond, 1969. <laughs> Shovelware's Brain Game. Some people may remember this from the late 80s to late 90s runs of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. This is PBS. For Kids TV, a former Saturday morning block responsible for airing shows reduced by four kids. Which I hated in my opinion because of the unnecessary anime censorship. But the only good show from 4Kids TV that I like the most was Sonic X, although I haven't entirely watched it yet. This is PBS. Creatora, a cartoon series from the digital universe. That's what Ben Curb is often obsessed with these days. True story. Hi guys, just came to check out the place. Wait a minute. Is that fan from Inanimate Insanity? I think that's him, Evan. But normally, both him and Microphone are always, you know, occupied by the Fujitsu effect in random ways. Oh, wait a minute. I know this guy. He used to be a part of the Minecraft News Gun Crazy. I was. Until I quit my job for personal reasons. But yeah, since I am not allowed to return to Minecraft, yeah. I decided to move to Raffle City because it's safe there. I live in Soap's mansion close to your place. Cool. So does that mean you're staying with us? Just for visits. Nothing else. Hello everyone. Cool place you got there. Microphone. You made it. Wow. What a surprise. First fan came in, but now microphone. Are these Soap's flatmates? Yes we are. I'm actually Soap's sister by the way. And I didn't know Soap had a sister. Neither did I, Michael. I mean, what's next? Now what in the name of Paul Rubens is this abomination? My name is Evelox6101. Jeez Louise! What is my evil club doing here? Whoa, 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 whoa! We got another doppelganger in our hands! What do you want? Evil Alex, why have you come here? To cause trouble, what else? Is that all you could ask for? Don't you know what we went through? We lost a good friend of ours thanks to Rufus. Yet, we still don't know who was the person responsible for nearly killing me during the hostage situation in June. You want to hear the truth, G4P? Well, you'll get one. And it will be a lot sooner than you think. That's enough. If you don't leave, we're telling God and his angels to beat you back. Do you really think you could get away with this? You can't. Now you are all going to face the consequences. On the way. Yep! We raised our crosses high and the poop boomeranged at him! <laughs> or as I'd like to say, you know reversed. Yeah. What have you done? Ew. Ew. Looks like that infernal goon has got a taste of his own medicine. Now to dispose of him. Actually, we'll take care of him, Angela and God. It's morphine time! Mugiru! Curses. 
I've been eaten. I leave that, you cowards. Ow. There! He's eliminated from our way! Serves him right. Now let's try going back to work. Uh-oh. Missing side. We know, Scotty. We got the saying. Excuse me, we're looking for Hank O'Hare. Is he available? I'm right here, Officer Flanagan. What can I help? We'd like you to come down to the station for questioning. What? Why? Does it have anything to do with Joshua's murder? No, it's not about him. Hank O'Hare, we are placing you under arrest over the suspicion of assault. What? You have the right not to make a statement, but anything you do say will be used as evidence against you. Jimmy, I know this was all you're doing. I'm gonna kill you for this. Threat me all you want, Hank. I still deserve some justice. Sorry, we are closed. You? What do you want? Answers. I want some answers. I don't have time for this right now. Don't act stupid, you stupid woman. I want to know where Geronimo is. Listen, Geronimo is not here. He skipped the country, remember? Liar. No, I am not lying, I swear. I told you, Geronimo's not here. Why do you want to see him? That's none of your business. It's a private manner. Rufus, don't you know what you've done to Flower? You kill her. You let those ex Hades members shoot and kill Flower without reasoning. She was an innocent person. You can't kill her like that. As Matthew Lieber, I got every right to kill whoever I want. You're just like Tony Soprano. You control everything, gaining strength to carry out crimes, and worst of all, teaming up with Hades to ruin our lives. What kind of man are you? I'm gonna go to the police and tell them that you killed John- no! You are not calling the police. Do you understand? You're not telling them anything. I'm getting sick to the back teeth of your attitude. Who do you think you're twisting my brain like that? It's despicable. If you dare tell the police, it's not just you that will be destroyed. It's your flatness as well. So all I'm asking is, back the hell off. Are we clear? I said are we clear.